She has changed the lives of millions of people. Between the work with cancer and organ transplantation and uh, infectious diseases, she has changed the whole way that people are cared for. And so millions of people literally will have been treated with her medicines all over the world. Her guiding principle has been to discover, develop, and make available to people medicines to treat diseases that are either untreatable or poorly treatable. Well, designer drugs was what Hitchings and Alien were doing way back in the 19th, late 40s and 50s. They saw meta found metabolic steps, and then they designed drugs to interfere with those metabolic steps in hopes that they would have a use, either in cancer or infectious disease or something else. I think uh, the way in which it, the, their, their idea developed and the success of it uh, was really the uh, background of all the new designer drugs that have produced the H2 blockers, the uh, anti-inflammatory uh, drugs, uh, the whole new uh, approach of the pharmaceutical industry to producing designer drugs to interfere with a specific chemical reaction. Trudy um, synthesized medicines that made it possible to treat cancer patients far more safely, such as allopurinol. She devised the initial therapies that were so critical for the uh, first uh, attempts to cure childhood leukemia, like 6-MP. She had the fundamental discoveries that allowed us to do organ transplantation with Imuran. Trudy has really revolutionized virtually every aspect of medicine that an oncologist would practice in. Better drugs, better ways to give other drugs more safely. She's, she's just changed the entire field. There's no comparison. From my point of view, her le legacy is the en entire field of antiviral chemotherapy. I mean, it was, you know, just uh, an orphan out there. Now it's a mainstream field um, in which anti-herpes drugs, anti-HIV drugs, anti-hepatitis B drugs, now anti-influenza drugs um, uh, are just burgeoning. Uh, the major scientific activity in infectious disease, to some extent, is, is really in antivirals. Uh, and acyclovir fostered that entire field, and that is a pretty impressive legacy. Now, you could also say that her legacy is anti-cancer anti, um, uh, chemotherapy with, with um, uh, 6-MP. And you could say her <laughs> legacy is, is gout also uh, uh, with uh, allopurinol. So uh, she's given us lots of legacies, and that's why uh, she's a Nobel Prize winner.